Recently, a Chinese battery manufacturer has unveiled ultra-fast charging cells. And surprisingly, it's not industry leader KL. Goshen High Tech, a rival to China's most prominent and successful EV and battery developer, announced two new fast charging batteries that breaks 10-minute charge barrier in EV battery race, along with cutting-edge solid-state technology at their annual conference. As Tesla continues its partnership with KTL to advance battery technology, the question arises, will Tesla pivot to collaborate with Goshen? What are the unique capabilities of Goshen's new batteries? And how might they transform Tesla's vehicle lineup if a partnership materializes? In today's video, we'll delve into these questions, comparing Goshen's innovations to Cattle's offerings and exploring the potential implications for Tesla's future models. How could Goshen's fast charging battery be Tesla's next big move? Goshen High Tech, a major competitor to KDL, has introduced two new fast charging batteries with features that could significantly impact the electric vehicle market. Here are the specific details about these batteries. One of the standout innovations is the G-Current battery. According to ETN, this 5C battery can charge up to 80% in just 9 minutes and 48 seconds, and reach 90% in 15 minutes. It is versatile enough to be used in electric and hybrid vehicles, compatible with lithium iron phosphate, lithium manganese iron phosphate, and nickel manganese cobalt lithium chemistries. Goshen has enhanced the conductivity of the lithium ion electrolyte by 30% to 50%, resulting in a thinner battery pack with 30% fewer components. This means it can be installed in various types of electric vehicles, from coupes to SUVs. G-Current will be available in two versions. The LFP variant, which does not use rare metals, is more affordable, while the conventional nickel manganese cobalt version offers a longer range. Importantly, the G-Current battery is ready for mass production, which could revolutionize charging speeds for electric vehicles if widely adopted. Goshen has already started mass-producing G-Current batteries for long-range electric vehicles and hybrids, with a production line for fully electric vehicles set to begin later this year. Moreover, Goshen's second fast-charging battery, the Stellary, promises equally impressive advancements, made from second-generation silicon carbon and featuring a fast-charging electrolyte. The Stellary can increase its charge from 10% to 70% in just 9 minutes. In terms of range, current estimates suggest the Stellary battery can provide 217 miles with just 5 minutes of charging and 372 miles with 10 minutes of charging. A Goshen report highlights that Stellary is uniquely designed to dissipate 70% of heat externally within 3 seconds, a critical safety feature. Its wireless battery management system further ensures reliability. Like the G-Current, the Stellary battery is ready for mass production, paving the way for widespread adoption in future electric vehicle models. This battery will be produced at Goshen's Gen 7 UM-Level facility, which aims to reduce production costs by 50%. Beside these two, there is another noteworthy development from Goshen. It is the Gemstone battery, which utilizes all solid-state technology. This solid-state battery offers higher energy density, significantly enhancing the range of electric vehicles. With an energy density of 350 watt-hours per kilogram, the Gemstone battery surpasses most NCM batteries by 40%, contributing to greater driving ranges and improved energy efficiency. The deployment of this technology is planned for 2027, with commercialization expected by 2030, potentially offering a driving range of 1,000 kilometers, 621 miles, on a single charge. Although this is a longer-term prospect, if successful, solid-state battery technology could revolutionize the EV industry. After we talked about these three, which battery do you prefer? If you'd like the G-Current in your Tesla, comment 1. For the Stellary, comment 2. If you want the gemstone, comment 3. How do Goshen and Cattle stack up in the EV battery race? As the trend of owning new energy vehicles, NEIVs, rises, so does the issue of long queues at charging stations during holidays. To address this, manufacturers are striving to shorten charging times. Currently, the industry standard for EV platforms is 400 volt chargers, but developers are now competing to create batteries compatible with 800 volt chargers. Goshen High Tech is a formidable competitor to KTL, supplying its batteries to several prominent automakers. For instance, Volkswagen uses Goshen's lithium-ion batteries in their ID, 3 and ID, 4 models. These batteries, featuring lithium-iron phosphate technology, 
are renowned for their safety and longevity compared to traditional lithium-ion batteries. Similarly, NIO incorporates Goshen's nickel cobalt manganese and LFP batteries in some versions of their ES6 and ES8 SUV models. Great Wall Motors Aura brand uses Goshen's advanced batteries in its R1 and R2 models, and Geely's Geometry A and C models also utilize these batteries. Jack Motors IEV6E, a popular electric vehicle, benefits from Goshen's durable and safe LFP batteries. In addition, with three new types of batteries currently in development, the competition between Goshen and KTL is expected to intensify even further, as both companies strive to advance their technology and expand their global market presence. Goshen's competitive edge is further bolstered by its recent agreement with the Moroccan government to build a large-scale battery manufacturing plant. This facility, with an initial production capacity of 20 gigawatt hours and a $1.4 billion investment, could expand to 100 gigawatt hours with a total investment of $6.5 billion. Morocco's strategic location near Europe, free trade agreements with EU markets, and robust automotive manufacturing infrastructure were key factors in this decision. Supported by Volkswagen, which holds a 26.47% stake in Goshen, the company targets a global battery capacity of 300 gigawatt hours, with around 100 gigawatt hours aimed at markets outside China. Goshen has already rolled out battery packs from its plants in Germany, Thailand, and the United States. KTEL, the global leader in EV batteries headquartered in Ningde, China, introduced its Shenzhen Plus battery at the Beijing Auto Show in April. This new LFP battery boasts a range of 600 kilometers after just 10 minutes of charging and can achieve 1,000 kilometers on a full charge. Cattle, officially known as Contemporary Amperex Technology, also produces the Shenxin battery, which began mass production in late 2023. These batteries are featured in EVs from Zhejiang Geely Holding Group under the Zeker brand, as well as Cherry Automobile's Exceed line. At the Beyond Expo Tech Forum in Macau, KTL's chairman and CEO Robin Zing highlighted that EVs equipped with Shenxin batteries perform like traditional combustion engines due to their fast charging capabilities. Zeng also mentioned KTL's next goal, developing technology to provide sufficient driving range with just a six-minute charge. European and South Korean automakers have been pioneers in high-voltage charging. In 2019, Porsche launched the Taycan EV, capable of charging at 800 volts. The 2024 Taycan, using LG batteries, can charge from 10% to 80% in 18 minutes. Hyundai Motors Ioniq 5 also features 800 volt charging capabilities. Now Chinese EV manufacturers are following suit, with NEVs compatible with 800 volt technology expected to proliferate in the Chinese market. According to Suchow Securities, a Chinese brokerage firm, 125,000 NEVs in China utilized 800-volt platforms last year, a number expected to increase 11-fold to 1.32 million by 2025. China's EV industry has excelled in developing fast-charging technology for both NCM and LFP batteries, the latter of which powers 60% of the EVs on the market. LFP batteries could bring EVs to mainstream market prices. Goshen aims to incorporate its new battery series into mid-size B-segment NIVs, which constitute over 30% of the market. In summary, Goshen High Tech is fiercely competing with KTL, positioning itself as a significant player in the global EV battery market through strategic partnerships, advanced battery technology, and ambitious production plans. What is the potential impact on Tesla's current and future models if partnering with Goshen? Tesla Known for its flexibility in using various battery suppliers and fostering partnerships with advanced providers, might adopt Goseon's fast charging technology in the future, enhancing its EV lineup. The new battery technologies could result in a dramatic reduction in charging times, significantly enhancing the convenience and efficiency of Tesla's vehicles. Models like the Model 3 and Model Y could see charging times reduced to under 10 minutes for an 80% charge, making long distance travel much easier and reducing downtime for charging. This enhancement would increase the appeal of Tesla vehicles among consumers who prioritize quick recharging capabilities, addressing one of the major barriers to EV adoption, range anxiety, and charging time concerns. Additionally, the enhanced range capabilities provided by Goshen's batteries could extend the driving range of Tesla's flagship models. 
The Model S and Model X, for example, could see their ranges increase to over 400 miles per charge, making them even more competitive in the long-range EV market. This extended range would be particularly attractive to consumers looking for vehicles capable of long-distance travel without frequent recharging. The affordability and scalability of Goshen's battery technology could also help Tesla reduce production costs. This cost reduction could allow Tesla to lower the prices of its vehicles, making them more accessible to a broader market and fostering greater adoption of electric vehicles. More affordable models like the Model 3 or the anti-pated Model 2 with $25K price tag could become even more competitive, potentially increasing Tesla's market share in the mid-range EV segment. Additionally, switching to these advanced batteries in Tesla models would come with further benefits, including a $7,500 federal tax credit, savings on gas and maintenance, and the significant environmental impact of eliminating 10,000 pounds of carbon dioxide pollution from our atmosphere each year. Advanced safety features from Goshen's battery technology, such as improved heat dissipation and wireless battery management systems, could enhance the safety and reliability of all Tesla models. These features would address concerns about battery overheating and ensure optimal performance, potentially reducing the risk of battery-related incidents and further bolstering Tesla's reputation for safety. Moreover, compatibility with Tesla's existing supercharger network would create a significant advantage. If Goshen's battery technology can integrate seamlessly with Tesla's extensive fast charging infrastructure, it would provide a substantial competitive edge for both Goshen and Tesla, leveraging the established supercharger network to enhance the user experience. In conclusion, a partnership with Goshen could provide Tesla with faster charging solutions, longer driving ranges, cost-effective battery options, and advanced safety features. These advancements would not only enhance the performance and appeal of Tesla's current models, but also pave the way for innovative future developments, solidifying Tesla's position as a leader in the electric vehicle industry. What do you think about the possibility of Tesla collaborating with Goshen? Do you want Goshen's battery technology on your future Tesla model? Share your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel Adam Tech to stay updated with our latest content. Goodbye, and see you again.